Well, you didn't miss much. I've lost track already of how many times I've died. It's okay, though. It's okay. Maybe I should try actually playing the game to win. <laughs> that arrow went like right through my heart. these foot soldier swords. Maybe if I get a high enough strength and dexterity I can like power wield them or whatever. That, that was the thing in this game, right? Power wielding? You, like you you need like double the uh, strength and dexterity requirement and then you do wield them and you get like a unique move set that does slightly more damage or something like that. guys or something else. What is it? I don't know you, and you don't know me. Things are better that way. I don't know, you sound kind of hot. I think I'd like to get to know you. <laughs> you are an odd one. Normally, people keep a safe distance when they see this mask. But you... I'm called Lucatil. Hmm. From the land of Mira to the far east, across the mountains. It's a strange way to spell best waifu. The Sadran Lake brims with powerful souls. And so I came to claim my share. But what a strange place. Even the rumors did not prepare me. Hmm. You are an odd one indeed. I've always made a point of avoiding people. While you've made a point of engaging me. I can see that you are mid-journey. If you require assistance, I will help you. Same I come budget. from Mira, a land of knights. My sword is always ready. Don't hesitate to call upon me. Whatever happens, I won't be missed. <laughs> Uh, I'll miss you, damn. You are an odd one indeed. While well, you've made I can see I come, don't I 
Now she has a quest line, and in order to take it to its conclusion, you have to summon her for boss fights, and then beat the boss with her her phantom still alive. But in order to actually get her help at each uh, boss encounter, you need um, God, what do you need? You need a uh, to talk to her. You need to find to a, her and talk to her in the area that she's in. Except for, I th think she's available for Smelter Demon. He's a boss of later. And, uh... That's, uh... Makes her, uh... Her summon sign appear to you. There's also another NPC here who uh, is worthwhile talking to. Hmm. I see light, but it remains dim. I am Carillion, and I've no interest in the magic impaired. Urge to kill rising. Now, uh, basically, like all other mages and sorcery characters. Uh, he will only go back to Majula and teach you sorceries if you've got, I think it's a minimum of eight intelligence or something like that. Uh, so you don't gotta be quite as smart as you do in the other Souls games, but, uh, yeah, he still makes you work for it, so. Heh, <laughs> tongue required ahead. Now let's see. There was some crazy thing attacking me over here, wasn't there? Something crazy jumped out. I was like, get fucked. Oh, that, that also works. Thanks. Thanks, game. Thanks. Okay. So let's use a human effigy. Up. Let's see if we can get all the way to the boss with our Estus intact. As much health as possible. And then also summon Lucatil. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me. Or I could just lose 70, 700 souls and and the fact that I used an effigy. That, that could also happen. <sighs> Why did I decide to let's play Dark Souls 2? Why did I take my sleep aid before recording? Why am I dumb? You know what? I'm having a hard enough time here. Let's see, applies darkness to right hand weapon. Okay, so come in this area. And there's an archer. And a Brangian dude. And here's the common. Etc. Get 
let's not say we did. Always with the shot. Okay, you gotta go, buddy. Got Luke Teal going for me now, at least, sort of, kind of. Let's make use of this dark resin. Not even for the boss, really, just to kill these guys on the boat. So that way I can waste another, yet another item. Ganking my NPC. Okay. Oh, you would do that, wouldn't you? The Twilight Herb I just got resource spell usages or something like that. It's been a long time since I fought this boss. And I'm not sure if I'm actually going to be able to beat it. And I'm also not sure if Darkness actually is going to help against it. And I also don't know if I'll be able to keep Luke Seal alive. Although she should just be able to sort of kill it. I think. Maybe. As you fight this buff, the longer it takes for you to kill it, the more this boat that we're in uh, fills up with water. So, something to keep in mind. If you're doing like really low damage to it. So. Yay, thanks, Bay. You tanked him good. You tanked him good. Menti flame and fireball. Mm. Could be useful, I guess. Hmm. Setting out, eh? How did the boat get turned around? Did it float into position backwards? Eh, whatever.
Okay, I somehow got onto the dock. Maybe Lucatil yeeted me across or something. Motherfucker. Not that bad. Despite all my days, I am still just a rat in a cage. Lots of souls. Now, for this Let's Play, I'm not going to try to show off nearly as much as I did in Dark Souls 1. I just don't know that much about the game. And, uh... As you can see, I'm not very good at it either. So, I'm probably just going to use all of my boss souls on myself. With a few exceptions. Let's go ahead and go back to the Emerald Herald and uh, get some level ups because I desperately need them. I need more HP and stamina. I am the sick. Er, suck. Not even the good type of suck. So I have more stamina. Nah, let's not do that. But let's, let's see. Could really use more damage too. wield these now, I think. So that, that'll be interesting, I guess. Maybe. Or maybe I should just stick with two-handing the broadsword. I don't know. Let's see, 139 in each hand. Yeah, that's like 159 in one hand, but... Still says 159. I don't know how Dark Souls 2 mechanics work. But yeah, I think I'm gonna call it there for now. And uh, if you watched, thanks for watching. And sorry about the abrupt ending to the second episode. Uh, <laughs> Maybe I should set these to record for an hour, which is the maximum amount a PS4 will allow. 
Or, I don't know, maybe I should do something else. I have no idea. Eh, whatever. Uh, anyway, see you again.